Hey, welcome back to Vlogmas Day 11. Stay tuned for the question of the day. All right, team, I love me, me, me. Thank you so much for coming back. So Vlogmas Day number 11 of 2017. It is now a new week. So welcome back. I'm glad that you stuck around. <laughs> okay, so the question of the day is, should I take the guy or girl that I meet at the club seriously? All right, so here's my answer to that. It really just depends. Okay, so I know that some people you know, go into the whole, you can't find anybody in the club to take them seriously or anything like that. However, I am actually on the opposite end of the spectrum because I used to go to the clubs. I used to dance and have a good time and drink and all that, all the stuff that occurs in the club for the most part, in reason. I used to partake in and I know that I'm a good person. I know that I'm a good girl and all that stuff. And so if I'm in the club, that has to mean that there has to be some good men that are in the club as well. So that is my take on it. If if I'm a good girl and I'm in the club, there has to be some good men that actually go to the club that want relationships. I'm not talking about the guys that want to hit everybody or even the girls, you know, because we, we can be raunchy too sometimes. We just a lot slicker and we a lot sneaker with it and we might go from club to club. But most of the time, the men stick on the prowl to certain places where we as women we're a little bit sneakier we can go all around but that's a different video yes you can take the men or women that you meet in the club seriously but of course just like anything else you have to qualify these people you cannot just meet them y'all have a good time for the first few days or even the first few weeks and think that they are going to be your husband or your wife you still have to get together and um, spend quality time together you still have to ask a multitude of questions you still have to you know let them meet your friends and family and um, and they meet your friends and family and so there are things that you still must do there are steps that you still must do in order to find out if this guy or this girl is going to be right for you now let me also say that there are certain um people that you would look for if you're going to take them seriously so what i mean by that is so for instance for you ladies that are listening if the guy that is approaching you or the guy that you happen to be bold enough to approach yourself. If he is the guy that is circling around the room, he hugging everybody because he is the guy that is the um, regular there, that is probably not the guy that you should try to take serious. That is probably not the guy that if he comes to give you his number or comes to talk to you to see if he can get your number, that um, he's going to want a full-time, serious, long-term relationship, especially if that's what you are looking for. Now, am I knocking the guy? Absolutely not. I'm just letting you know some of the things that you could look out for. So now, after saying that, the guy that you, and you have to be bold when I'm saying this, young lady, the guy that you should be bold enough to go and speak to is the guy that's kind of back in the cut, watching the scene. He might be having a drink or something. He might even be checking out everybody as far as his eyes, but he's not in everybody's face. He's not making his rounds. He's not giving everybody hugs and, you know, and good to see you and all that stuff, and especially the bartenders, because if he's doing all that, he's absolutely a regular. Now, let me back up and say, could he know the owner and all of this stuff? Yes, he can. But in the interest of this particular video and just kind of making sure that every, everything kind of comes together, usually the guy that is working the room is not the guy that you should be looking to settle down with. Yeah, I'm pushing past the fine one. That's that's hugging everybody. Pushing past, and you're looking for the one that's in, in the cut, in chill mode status. That might be the guy that you should approach to have a conversation with. You can even see if he is a regular. You know, just you just never know. The point is, yes, you can take the guy or girl that you meet at the club seriously, but you still have to qualify them. Now, for you fellas... 
the girl that you are looking for, if you're looking for a relationship, the girl that you are looking for at the club is the one in the group that might even be the quietest. But actually, um, there are a plethora of stages that women can kind of go through, even if they are looking for a relationship. You might not never know it because women, especially still nowadays, we really would like for the man to approach. We would, but you know, that's a that's a different video and a question that I will be answering as well. But um, so you can approach, you know, a different um, the group of women or whatever, or one or two women. And there's again, you still have to qualify them as well, because if you, you have some women that are regulars, too, they might be circling around the bar and giving everybody hugs and know the bartenders just as well. That is not the one especially if you're looking for a relationship that is not the one that you are looking to wife up uh that that that's not the one you're going to have some issues especially if you go to the bar and club scene every once in a while and if she's doing all of this stuff right she is a regular and that might actually be her thing like i have a um a friend of mine who like she really loves the club like really loves the club like to the point where um my sister was talking to her and just asking her some questions or whatever and she was like like she basically saying how she wanted a relationship right but so this guy that she got what is basically not her speed and what i mean by that is because he don't really like to go to the club but instead of her like kind of going with the flow or even cutting back on the club she's like uh-uh now he trying to hold me back i want to go to the club like i love the club like she's the bartender in the clubs like she's in and out of the club like she the club is her thing. So I'm not just saying that men are only the ones who like to do this. I know some people that are on both ends of the spectrum who like to do this, but those are not the people that you're looking for because that is a recipe for disaster. You are setting yourself up for downfall. So finally, yes, you can take the person serious in the club that you meet. You just have to be smart about your questions. You have to be smart about um, paying attention to their behavior. And if all else fails, all you have to do is just not go back to the club or go back to that club and just, you know, say hi and move on with life. You don't have to be rude. Now, if this is your very first time to I Love Me, 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 I would love for you to hit that red subscribe button because here at I Love Me, 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 I'm supplying you guys with the tips and tools in order to have happy, healthy, romantic relationships. I love you so much and I will see you tomorrow. Mwah.